Only three things last for eternity. God, God's word, the human soul. That extra shift you work may pay another bill. It might allow you to get a nicer car. Uh, your all-nighter might get you a better grade. Your social media plunge might find you a new friend. Your Netflix binge may make you laugh or cry. But focus on eternity. Glenn Hall invested in me. His parents, Mr. and Mrs. Hall, invested in me. My youth pastor, Doug and Beth Dry, invested in me. Ron, the leader of the Navigators Christian Ministry at the University of Connecticut, invested in me. Dan and Jan Guterres, leaders at the, the NAVS Ministry at Western Washington University, invested in me. My wife, Janine, invests in me. Our cousins, Butch and Kathy Espy, invested in me. Galen Norsworthy, invested in me. Ken Hutcherson, Carl Payne, the Young Marriage Group from Antioch Bible Church, Ed Davies, they all invested in me. Uh, Rick Warren, Tom Holliday, Doug Fields invested in me. Uh, the people at Mosaic Manhattan Church in Lower Manhattan invested in me. Uh, my professor, Leonard Sweet, invested in me. Ben Ward, Jim Owens invested in me. And then there's two men's groups that I've been in in the last two years where Lou, Mike, and Mark invested in me. And right now, Chris, Jordan, and Grant, these men have invested in me. Only three things last for eternity. Say no to a boring life. Say yes to a faith that matters. And take the Jesus challenge.